I mean, I think, uh, looking back on the history, I think it's like all theaters of its age, so we're 48 years old this year and we're heading towards the 50th anniversary. Um, Canadian theater itself isn't, uh, isn't really that old, and so this is one of the oldest companies in the country, and to look at what Walter Learning and all the people that built this place with him and the Playhouse um, did and have done in those early years is remarkable. Like the idea of building a theater company, having this incredible venue, and then touring all over the province uh, a number of shows to a number of locations is like it's 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 almost unbelievable, uh, and it's hugely inspirational. And then I think going through all the years of the company, seeing that. Uh, they continued those traditions of excellence and that each artistic director um, tried things with their own imaginations on how they could uh, inspire and entertain and challenge the audiences of their time. I think is great. Um, I think when the company uh, ran into a bit of difficulty, what's really inspirational to me is um, in speaking to colleagues and reading about it online is how vital everyone feels this theater company is and uh, the goodwill and grace and offers from everyone that went into making sure that this company stayed a company and then helping it get back on its feet. And now that it's back on its feet, watching that it's not only uh, continued the things that it had been doing, but it's like thriving with world premieres that we've purchased the building that we're speaking in right now, that a new studio theater is coming. Um, and so to be arriving at a time like on the standing on the shoulders of all of that is uh, is incredibly exciting because I think where it can go is to continue to tour to create theater but to continue to expand our ideas of how we engage audiences um, whether that's here in the studio whether that's the playhouse whether that's um, arts experiences that happen uh, in the city if that's uh, a return to touring but maybe um, with different shows or in different ways, initiating new collaborations with different art forms and getting people talking, um, offering professional development for artists, which I think is going to be a, a big part of what we're going to be uh, doing that may be uh, new in a different way than, than the theatre school, which is brilliant and has been like um, immeasurably affecting the lives of young people for the, you know, the entire history of, it, of its existence, but also um, offering professional development that helps actors both nationally and provincially to uh, to raise our, our standards, and myself included, so that we're always uh, growing and challenging each other. Um, so I think there's, you know, we're, we're standing on great shoulders and we're in great shape, and now uh, there's amazing, almost um, incalculable places that we can go.